Most recently, British Financial Investigations Advisor to the Special Organized Crime Unit, SOKU, Dr. Sam Sitlinton, bemoaned the low rate of convictions for financial crimes as he addressed a training seminar. The British expert noted that there are a lot of cases get into court but also failing at that same level. He also noted that files are oftentimes sent back with corrections from the Office of the Director of Public Prosecutions, the PP. But opposition leader Barrett Jacklio says that Soko's mandate is not being delivered, especially since it has taken political directives, which undermines its professionalism. I don't think the focus has been ever on, on preparing good cases and let the evidence lead you to the cases. It started a different way. They got an instruction, the special prosecutors were hired, a hundred million set aside outside of the DPP's office. The money was placed in the AG's budget. Harman said in Parliament he's budgeting to top up the SOKU officers in his ministry, the Ministry of Presidency. So immediately they undermined the chain of command where SOKU is an arm of the police police force. Jack Duforda argues that this is the main reason why the cases are failing. So we've heard a lot about a, a billion dollars fraud at the gold board. Billion dollars fraud. Where, where that disappeared? We heard about one PS which we had 18 billion they told us. Kaichonu said 18 billion was stolen or something like that. Where is that case? Where the cases? The, were these all just headlines? The opposition leader feels that Soku has come under a lot of political pressure to go after people based on politics. Jack Dio has long stated that Soku has now been converted into a People's National Congress PNC outfit with its main objective to carry out witch hunts. Soku has already called in Jack Dio, former head of the presidential secretariat, Dr. Roger Lungeon, among other former ministers, for questioning in relation to the Pradoville to Osaka. Only recently, another batch of these former PPP government ministers were called in for questioning again for the same matter. Samuel Signandin, The Evening News.